Hello, Air Signs. This is Lex. I'm here with your What Do You Need to Know reading. In this reading, we are asking for any advice, um, any pointers, anything that may be coming to you in the near future, or maybe just things that you may need to redirect your focus upon. Okay. Um, what I am doing is for the What Do You Need to Knows at the end of the month, the video that has the most views, I will do individual readings for the signs in that element. So air signs, you're going to be Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra. Okay, so if at the end of the month you have the most views, then I will do general readings for each of your signs. Okay, so get those views up, air signs. All right, if you have not already, please hit that subscribe button. If this resonates with you, give me a thumbs up and a comment. If it does not, that happens. Just check one of the videos for either your moon rising or Venus sign as those sometimes resonates with us better. Okay, let's get started. Holy Spirit, please anoint the cards, allow them to fall where they should and be the ability to interpret the way that I should. Give me clear cut, concise messages for my air signs and what they need to know. Jesus name I pray, amen. What do my air signs need to know? All right, air signs, you have number 13, release. The end of a phase or situation, spiritual transformation, time to move on. Okay, so air signs, you have been having kind of an ongoing theme where um, you've been holding on to something and things just really just couldn't get right for you, especially Aquarius, if I remember. Yeah, Aquarius, especially. But um, air signs in general. So it's telling you now's the time to release whatever that is and move forward. 13 reduces to a four and that is stability. OK, this is going to help you become more stable emotionally because this is a Scorpio card. It's going to help you become more stable emotionally so that you can be ready for the next phase in your life. All right. I'm going to clarify that now with my life purpose oracles and my gilded tarot. I have heart's desires. The angels are supporting, guiding, and protecting you as your dreams become reality. Okay, so out with the old, in with the new. Protected. You are safe and supported while you change your career. So if this is a job um, situation that you need to release, it is telling you that you are protected at this, um, at this time. Get my words out. And then your last um, oracle is spiritual teacher. You heal with your classes, sessions, and seminars, okay? So some of you um, are, feel, are doing some, um, you may be a philanthropist. I got that for some reason, for some of you. Some of you just may be doing more spiritual teachings and just um, sharing knowledge and information with others. But if that is the career change or what uh, maybe it's just a spiritual change, maybe um, you may have grown up in one religion, but you're considering moving to another one. It's telling you, yeah, go ahead and do that. This is for you. We're going to get a couple more clarifiers here. If it is a relationship, it's telling you to move on from then go ahead and do that as well. So I have the emperor. The emperor is a very structured, authoritative type of person. This could be an older male figure in your life, like a fatherly figure, it could be a boss or some sort of mentor that you respect highly. OK, it's also um, Aries card. And then I have six of pentacles. This is um, you becoming in more imbalanced, okay? You also could be receiving, um, some of you have received monetary gifts recently to help aid in whatever this is that you're doing next, okay? <laughs> okay, so to clarify that, I have the death card again. This is the same thing, release and death is the same as 13, at the top and see if y'all can see that okay yeah so that is double confirmation telling you that whatever you need to end
go ahead and squash it and move on to the next okay quit holding on all right air sign what i'm doing now is i'm pulling some whisper of love oracles what i'm asking for is um how to attract more love how to be more loving to ourselves and others and if you are currently in a relationship, what we're asking for is how to sustain, renew, and build on existing love. Okay. Let's see how many we get for you on this one. Three. Okay. First one I have is be supportive. Make a genuine effort to show you care. Appreciate this moment. Each and every situation has an opportunity to grow and find love. And forgiveness. Nothing can be gained by holding on to past disappointments. Um, another element got this. I think it was fire signs got this. So you could be dealing with the fire sign. I wanted to say earth for some reason, but no, I believe it's fire sign that got this. So yeah, definitely the need to end one phase and move on to the next. This is you just elevating and transitioning to the next level. Um, this isn't you leaving anyone behind. This isn't you hurting anyone's feelings or anything like that. Because what I've noticed, again, with the air signs, you're putting more, um, again, especially my Aquarius, you're you're not wanting to uh, stir the pot or rock the boat, so to speak. You're trying to keep the peace. And sometimes you just got to do stuff for you. All right. And not be a, and be non-apologetic about doing something for yourself okay you have the right you deserve to be happy as well okay i just want you to know that all right so what i want to do now is pull a card to pull all of this together tie it all up in your last and final message for your reading i have the nine of diamonds nine of diamonds is action towards um um, financial matters okay some something up here said career change yeah you're being protected okay you're protected while you make whatever this change is and you take this next phase this next step in your life you're protected so go ahead and make the action okay now you need to be about it all right air signs that is your what do you need to know i hope this helps and it resonates with you if it does not for some reason you may want to check one of the videos for either your moon rising or venus as though sometimes resonates with us better please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already give me a thumbs up or comment if this does resonate with you okay and if you would like to reach me there is a link to my website in the description below take care